Good morning, my lovelies, and welcome to a very frosty and cold Saturday morning. And it started snowing. And today, me and Miss Lou are at Belgrave Lakes. It's a series of lakes that's connected up with Stony Delph. And they run from the top pools at the top down the brook through this big pole and then it comes out at a little brook at the bottom and then that brook runs into Tamworth. It's been here for as long as I can remember and I've been in Tamworth 40 years. So yeah, it's been here a long time and everybody uses it and it is, it's a lovely little area to be. It's another one of our hidden gems. So how is everybody today? I hope we're all well and I hope we're all looking after ourselves. Well, thank God that we're nearly towards the end of January because I don't know about you, I don't do January. I find January very dull and very boring. Um, I'm not a January fan. I mean, you've just got over Christmas. And it's always a bit, it's always a bit cold and wet and dark and miserable. There's not a lot going on. It's all right, Louis, tell you the swans having a word. There's not a lot going on generally, so yeah. I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a January fan. I have just spotted the most majestic looking heron going. So I'm just going to pop over here and we're going to have a little look at this beautiful heron while she tries to dig up bloody ice. So, Lulu, can you see him? Look at him, isn't he beautiful? Let me see if I can just zoom in a little for you. Look at him. Isn't he beautiful? He's getting upset because the swans are fighting. I just thought he was beautiful, I thought I'd show you. Come on. Yes, so, as I was saying, I am not a fan of January. Um, and that is why I don't make New Year's resolutions, because I always think you're under a great deal of pressure to keep up with them um, and probably by about the third week in January you've fed up and had enough and lost the will to live with them so that's why I never make them. I always use January as a a bit like a subscription to a magazine where you get this magazine and you have a flick through and you think mm, yes I could I could get into that I could I could watch that you know I could read that and then February comes along so you pay your monthly subscription to the magazine and that's how I see January. I'll look at it, I think mm, is there anything I need to do, is there anything I want to do, do I need to change anything in life and if the answer is yes then I will spend January preparing for it, making pools for it so then Come February, I've got 11 months then to try and work at what you've got, if this is making any sense. So yes, 
I'm going to try hard this year to do something other than sit and stare into the abyss of the internet which is what I do with myself most nights and it's not good so fourth attempt this morning at trying to make a small video for you guys and we have now succeeded. Thank the gods and goddesses. So we're going to wander across this bridge here and then I think we'll call it a day and we'll make our way home for coffee. So, as always my lovelies, take care of yourselves, look after each other, sending you much love and many blessings.